Alright, welcome back. For the main event of Raw is War. They're coming out in the beginning of the of the of the show. Running his mouth. Bret Hart, the current champion, not having any of it. Challenging him to a match. The Rock at first declined, but Bret Hart had already planned for this. The GM okayed it. It's a submission match, and it is the main event, and it is right now. Here he comes, your WWF champion, Bret the Hitman Hart. Here comes La Rock getting major boos. The Brahma Bull Champion. This is a champion versus champion match. Whoever taps first will be the loser. The other man being the victor winning. Only days before Extreme Rules, ladies and gentlemen. Both of these gentlemen, both of these guys have to defend their titles possibly at Extreme Rules if they have a match. So is it wise to be fighting in a match that will make you so uncomfortable that you're going to have to tap your hand against the mat and tap out. I don't know. It's it's a little risky to me. I can't believe Bret Hart suggested it. What if The Rock sinks in his sharpshooter? What if, though, Bret Hart gets his submission move in? I don't know how this is going to go. I don't know who to play either. The Rock... Coming out to booze is the Brahma Bull champion. He just saw Triple H become number one contender. He's having not the greatest night in the world. Let's see if he can turn it around with a win. We've also had Stone Cold Steve Austin getting in this mix. Interrupting the Rock's matches. I think we have to be Bret Hart here. He's the champion. He's the one that you have to make sure is winning. Especially before big pay-per-views. But we need to work on Rocky's legs. I've never played as Bret Hart before in any game. I've never liked Bret Hart until I started watching his stuff and playing Attitude Era mode. And I'm starting to like Bret Hart. It's terrible, I know. The Rock poking Bret Hart in the eye. Oh. And we just keep... Working on those legs, and The Rock will have no choice but to tap out. We have to wear those legs down. Will Rock be able to recover if Bret Hart wins this match? And again, just knees. The Rock is not faring so well in this match. Oh. Gonna throw him into the ring post. Oh. The Rock is getting worked over by the WWF champion. Oh. Man, I thought we could target there. There we go. Now we'll be able to target. Oh, and a chop block. And we're just gonna go for a quick figure four. Weaken him a bit. Do as much damage as possible. Oh, and he turns it over. He turns it over, but we got to the rope. We're at the rope. Get him off me. He breaks it up. Submission moves are not The Rock's forte. He doesn't really submit too many people, but he's working on our legs now. Turnabout is fair play in this match. Both people having some signature moves dealing with submissions. Bret Hart, back suplex. Now working on more of the midsection in the legs of The Rock. The Rock is not going to be able to beat me. I've already weakened him too much. Oh, and a chop block. Rocky knows he's working on the legs as well. Who is going to win? Who is going to win the, the race to... Uh, 
to a, a tap out here. We're both working on the legs exclusively. Oh, and just dropping the full weight onto that knee. This is crazy. Both competitors attacking the legs. Where's Jack Swagger when you need him? Whipping him into the corner. Too late, Snake Eyes. Face right into the turnbuckle. Rock getting hung up on the ropes. And his legs are in yellow. And we are close to our signature, too. Rocky is going to be in some trouble. Oh, Bulldog. Come on. Oh. Let's go, Rock. I'm the best there was, the best there is, and the best there ever will be. I think I just screwed that up. Again, I don't watch a whole lot of, of Bret Hart, so forgive me if I do screw it up from time to time. What the hell? Oh, what a glitch. What a glitch. Boo. Boo. We're going to figure for him again. He gets to the ropes. Unbelievable that he just got that. Is his head yellow? Oh, okay, yellow. I thought I saw orange there for a minute. Now he's orange. Bret Hart ready. He's ready to finish this match. Clothesline to the rock. Elbows to the upper back. Rocky getting dominated here. Rock squeezing down on the head. Reverse. <laughs> and another knee to the leg of the rock. Oh, and we're just going to taunt our way back into the good graces of the finishing move. Run away. Off the ropes. Oh, we tried for a clothesline. We miss. Into the headlock. What should the people's champ be looking to do now, King? People's champion is looking to lose in this match. And another pile driver. Yeah, we're going to pull him in the middle this time. I don't want any mistakes. Here we go. Sharpshooter. Oh no, Rock's going to get to the ropes. No. No. Oh, no, he reverses it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, into the Samoan drop. Rock building momentum. We reverse one of his kicks. Punching. Punching. Belly to belly suplex. And a poke to the eye. The Rock is getting nippy. He's getting scared. He's starting to cheat. Oh, and a chop block. Bret Hart's ready for this match, though. He's ready to take out the big talker, The Rock. Oh, he's going to the top rope. He's going to the top rope out onto The Rock. Oh! Oh, my gosh, no. Out on... Oh, no. The padded area on the outside of the ring. A pile driver. Rocky's done. Whip him into the ring. Finish it. Oh. Maybe he's not done. He's getting a little... Uh... Oh, wow. Rock is just dominated here. He is pure red on the body. He's in the middle of the ring. No escape. No escape for the Rock. He's trying to reach the ropes. He's going to tap. And the Rock taps out to the WWF champion. Proving who should be the champion. Bret Hart wins. The first one didn't work. He got to the ropes. The first one glitched out. The second one he got to the ropes. But the third one connected after a pile driver on the outside. There's Rock's reversal into a Samoan drill. The punches. The belly belly suplex. That's where he really got the momentum going. Pile driver on the outside. 
leaving rock undefensible undefensible is that a word and in the sharpshooter and the rock he just taps out drama bull champion tapping out to the wwf champion here we go we got a moment and they're gonna shake hands the brahma bull champion the wwf champion they've each gained each other's respect the rock knows when he's a beat man Brett the hitman heart going into raw is war or i mean extreme rules as the champion as the dominant champion on the brand let's preview some smackdown Let's see what we got. What do we got here? Hopefully some news. No news? Still no news. Alright, so we're going to have Diamond Dallas Page going up against Unico. Cody Rhodes facing off against Christian. A number one contenders match for the women's championship. Nikki Bella. And Kelly Kelly. We have Sheamus versus Daniel Bryan and Undertaker versus Big Show in a Falls Count Anywhere match this time. No count outs. No count outs to save The Undertaker. Big Show was asked for this match and he is going to get it. Falls Count Anywhere against The Undertaker for the main event of SmackDown. They must be having that match because they are not involved in the Extreme Rules pay per view. That'll be an interesting card for a couple of reasons. This one, I'm interested to see what else goes on. Alright, well, there you go. Thank you for watching this video. Go ahead, like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Do what you gotta do. And we will see you for SmackDown. New Age Outlaws don't have any competition. We need to make some teams. That's what we need to do.